Welcome everyone. I am back. Today is July the 6th, 2022. We're going to talk about Celsius Network today and how it could be possibly game over. I mean, the, the particular company Celsius has laid off what some 23, 25 percent of the workforce trying to restructure the business, trying to restructure the company so they can, can remain viable, so that it can remain open. But is it too late? Welcome everyone to my channel. This is HFN, also known as Youth for News. I create price predictions off of the price chart. I don't focus in on the news. I don't focus in on what people are tweeting. I don't focus in on the video or content that other people are trying to create to figure out what the market is about to do. Because I've come to realize that the answers are already listed and plastered on the price chart. So rather than people speaking out on one side of their mouth and then actually do something totally different with the money that they have, always follow the money for real pay attention to the money and all of everyone's ideas transactions whether they're buyers whether they're sellers is all here in this one location the price chart so i want you all to see this i want you all to join me and watch how i showed you how you can predict where prices are going to go so i want you all to go ahead and hit that like button should have been also subscribe here to my channel tap that bell notification as well because if you haven't realized it just yet I'm probably one of the realest ones out here on these cryptocurrency YouTube streets giving you all the real. So if you guys want the real, I'm here. Now, here's the article right here from Coindesk. Okay, you guys can see that this article was posted two days ago, July the 4th, 2022, updated yesterday. Okay, crypto lender Celsius cuts 150 jobs amid restructuring. The withdrawals can't get your money out. They still have paused the withdrawals and the company has hired restructuring experts as it faces as it faces a financial crisis. You know what? I wouldn't be surprised if a lot of the regulators, you know, the SEC, uh, a lot of regulators across the world just sitting back laughing and seeing how the crash, the financial crisis, the deleveraging of the DeFi space is hitting a lot of these businesses. Because they want people to run to them and say, hey, we need some regulation. A lot of people have gotten burned from holding many of these cryptocurrencies or tokens or all coins. So they're just kicked back waiting for the overwhelmingly majority of the people to, to run to them and say, can we get some type of regulation here, please? This is too much like the Wild Wild West. I have no protection. This is what we're seeing being laid out right now. Now, will it happen? Will the regulators come to the rescue and save this one supposed decentralized arena? Will they do it? Or is this the, the object of being in cryptocurrencies is to work the kinks out all its own without the intervention of someone else to give it regulation? Just something to think about. You guys can see that. American Israeli crypto lender Celsius laid off some 150 employees as it battles a financial crisis that saw it halt customer withdrawals last month. The firm, talking about Celsius, has about 650 people that works and is listed on LinkedIn, including the executives, meaning that around 23% of the company was affected. They got pink slips. They said, don't come back to work. We're trying to restructure we having some issues and you're part of the issue. We need to reduce some of our expenses. So we got to get rid of you. So now, is that going to affect the cryptocurrency though? Because here's a chart. And best believe, right here on this exchange, right? OKX, Celsius has been in a downturn. Just a couple of months ago, look at this in May. When it first was listed on this particular exchange, it was around seven, eight dollars. And here it is today at 90 cents. 88 percent move lower. 88. Right now to where the price is. Now, you might see some people. I've seen a couple of uh, YouTube titles of individuals creating this short squeeze in Celsius. Don't fall into all of that. But um, you guys have seen over the last couple of days that, yeah, we've seen some increased volatility in this cryptocurrency. All right. We're going to break this down. 
and in order for us to break down what's going on on the price chart we got to recognize where the players are at there's only two players on this game you got the buyers and you got the sellers this is where the buyers are at okay the buyers are there around 50 cents and the sellers are positioned I would say right around here right now okay now a lot of these trading days right here I would consider like blow off tops to where the market had a lot of volatility a lot of movement higher that it was able to try to crack above one dollar and ten cents but it comes right back down now what does that mean well it seemed to me that there's still a whole lot of people trying to get about their position so now we got the game this is the game right here currently right now in Celsius this is what's going on which line do you think is more in jeopardy of being broken is it the lower line where the buyers are at 50 cents or is it the upper line the sellers at a dollar and ten which one do you think is going to break let's look at Celsius here on the two day okay because I really see the market holding support what we're getting so far is the creation of creating a strong firm support area for the buyers right now look at this last completed two-day price bar it represents that the market is not ready to break a dollar ten to the upside yet not yet this is in on three day so you guys can pretty much see the same thing here okay now I'll give you this let me show you if you see this happen the market in Celsius is going to break a dollar ten to the upside okay so we we're currently seeing selling coming to the market right now right the last three days coming into this current three day price bar the market is selling now on this move down okay if the market in Celsius does not break below this level right here which is around 80 cents we can expect the market to break a dollar ten higher so keep your eyes open right now to see whether or not the market price in Celsius is going to break 80 cents because if it doesn't that continues to confirm the bullishness that the buyers are in control right now I'm just here to give you the information so keep your eyes open on that 80 cent level because if the market comes down and the buyers comes in and support it that's a good sign okay outside of that I'm not looking for too much Okay, not looking for too much. All right, so let's go ahead because I still suspect that the market is, is trying to inch up higher. It's just not ready yet. So yeah, we definitely need to see that market run in and hold support at 80 cents. So what I'm going to do, because I am looking for the market in Celsius to run up, we're gonna go ahead and play the strength. But first, I want to tell you about that caveat if the market in Celsius does not hold 80 cents be prepared for it to fall down to 50 I'm just saying okay now my first price target is going to be up there around a dollar ten like I said we've seen majority of the price action ever since what May the 13th market finding restriction there so as we continue to see the market run up in mat i'm sorry in celsius then we need to be prepared to eat my first one is 110 my second is going to be around a dollar 20 that's around 36 percent move higher okay i'm gonna leave it there because i could possibly see it run up to like a dollar 40 but i'm not going to put that on the chart just yet so this is it my two price target is a dollar twenty and a dollar ten. All right, so I'm here. I am in position. I am expected market in Celsius to try to run up. Now they're in plans to try to restructure the company. There's no guarantee that they're going to be successful. The withdrawals are still on pause, so customers cannot withdraw any of the money, which is not a good thing. So this is why the price prediction is so short, so minuscule. And like I'm not looking for the market to run up to five dollars and not like that. That's crazy. But this is where I'm at. 
So I want you all to tell me what is your thoughts about Celsius? What do you think the market is about to go without the confusion? I've shown you what I thought. Now it's your turn. Let me know. Make sure you maintain the profitability and as always trade different.